here she is playing on this on this huge team uh, in in 1933. So the Ramblers were in business from 1933 to uh, 1965. Dot played every one of those years. Um, let's go back to 1934. I know that you're not great with dates, but I know you know this. I want to talk a little bit about that very first World Champions. The first World Championship uh, for softball was held in 1934 at Soldier Field in Chicago. And um, Dot was there. She was on the team. Uh, just take them there for a minute and talk what it was like to walk into this stadium. T well, we were at, uh, it was at Chicago in um, Soldiers Field, which is still there. But there was 20 men's teams and 20 women's teams all lined up in the basement of Soldier Field. And I guess I was 12 years old then, as I look back to see, because I remember going, but, you know, don't remember all that. All anybody ever seems to know about that period is um, a league of their own. And let me tell you, I'm going to set the record straight right up front so we don't get these kinds of questions a little bit later. That was the very smallest part of what was going on in women's softball at that time. But you told me a really interesting story about what would happen when uh, you had to go on the road for a road trip. You'd leave on Thursday. Yeah, when, when we worked for air research, or when we tell them, well, we're not going to be here tomorrow or the next day, well, you got fired. You, they wouldn't let you give you a couple of days or anything. You just lost your whatever it was, all your time. But then on Monday morning when we came back, we just walk in the door and go back to work. But you, you're just rehiring all over again. Nobody, nobody would give you the time off to go and play ball. I was close to my teammates. I was close to my coaches. And it's just like now. I love everybody because I, I love people. And I want people to care about me. And I think they do. I've had so many good experiences. And softball has meant more to me than I could ever tell anybody. Diz straightened up. Elsie was right. She could do everything Franny could do just as well or better. Diz pounded her fist into her glove and peered in as Amy launched the next pitch. But Dot, for those of you who don't know, is a 19-time uh, All-American, more All-American honors than anybody else in existence. Three-time world champion, an inductee into two Hall of Fames. 